I don't know. I was trying to kill myself, I think. Ma'am, you've said that many times, that you tried to kill yourself, right? In court. I don't know that many, but I've recounted a time that I did. You've, you've, you've said it more than three, four, five times, right? Perhaps. And uh, in fact, one of the things that you told us about was that, well, when you were in the, the Maricopa County Jail, that you tried to kill yourself, right? No, Siskiyou County Jail. Siskiyou County Jail. So you do remember that. And that when you tried to do that, you took some Advil. Do you remember telling us about that? Yes. And that what you did then is you took some a razor, right? Yes. And that you cut yourself, right? It was a nick. It was a nick. And because it stung so much, that you said, nah, this is not the way for me to go, right? I didn't say that. I just... You said it stung, and that's why you stopped. Isn't that what your direct testimony was? That night, yes. Right. And that's the night that I'm talking to you about, right? Yes. I'm not talking to you about any other night, am I? It sounded like you were. No. And just to be clear, I'm not talking about any other night, am I? Do you understand that? Okay, I understand that. And you nicked yourself, and it hurt, right? Yes. And I thank you the word that you used, stung, right? Yes. To use your standard, ma'am, of how you stop because it's stung. Can you imagine how much it must have hurt Mr. Alexander when you stuck that knife right into his chest? That really must have hurt, right? Humanitative. Just a 